I'm Caitlin Henderson from Waffle TV and joining me on the couch is Band Matt. Hello. Welcome guys. Thank you very much. So first of all, Chocolate has described you as Flight of the Concords meets 8 Mile. Do you think this is an accurate description? Uh, it's, it's, a, it's a nice description. Yeah. It's, it's one that kind of sums up. We are musical comedians and uh, it's all through hip hop. Yeah. So in that sense, it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's all that but everything, I mean it, like 8 Mile, that kind of Hip hop balancing, yeah. everything we do is always improvised. Yeah. I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, one of my favourite movies, one of my favourite comedy exactly. duos. Why not? It's a lovely thing. So, when did um, you develop like this talent? When did you get together and start? Uh, rapping? Well, well, the, the rap side started uh, years ago. It started for me back in Ireland when I was like 14, 15. In Dublin, in, yeah. In Dublin, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and kind of some of the older. Older people in my area were playing a lot of hip hop. Yeah. Got quite into it. Yeah. Um, I remember trying to rap along, thinking yeah. like I'm rapping the lyrics. Yeah. And I'm dropping like <laughs> I said a lyric about like the T shirt, which yeah. is the Irish version of the Prime Minister, and one of these older guys was yeah. like, "No, that's not the lyric. That's <laughs> Wu Tang don't rap about the Irish government." Yeah. And, and it was around then that I realised that I was just really bad at listening to lyrics. Yeah. And that's how I kind of realised a lot of what I was doing from from that age was probably very. It was my initial bits of freestyle. Yeah, and um, at your shows, I've seen before you literally just pick an audience and you can rap about. I've seen Greg the Accountant. You can just <laughs> rap about anything. Do you ever kind of freak out if you get someone and you think I don't know how I'm going to rhyme with this? It's not so much rhyme. I think it, I think it's you occasionally meet someone and you go, "There's no story. Yeah, there's nothing oh, I can there's do with nothing. this. Give me something." <laughs> That's what I always end up saying. Is I'm yeah. like, just have fun, just yeah. be silly, and I'd almost rather someone go, you know. What do you want to be when you grow up? And just like a one armed dinosaur that, uh, that <laughs> yeah. tours with Run DMC. That's yeah. much easier exactly. than someone being like a footballer. Yeah. <laughs> just do so, you can do much more. The sillier the suggestion, yeah, the better exactly. it is. And um, so your friend regulars, you performed at Glastonbury yes. and Daisy Lowe's 21st. Yeah, yeah, that was an interesting <laughs> gig. How was that? It's all right, actually. Yeah. It feels like everything I say from here on in is name dropping, but it's not. Yeah. I, was, I was hired help. But you can sell your show, it's um, fine. It's not, it's not even that, it's just that my favorite moment at that party was we were standing outside uh, a group of us, a group yeah. of performers. Uh, I was there with a group called House of Fairy Tales. Yeah. I was kind of a rap part of, of a show we were putting on. So we're standing outside, eight of us, this little circle, yeah. and everyone's kind of rapping and beatboxing. Yeah. And suddenly, this just this voice comes out of nowhere and starts dropping amazing lyrics. Yeah. And I look over, and it's dark, it's dark outside. Yeah. I'm like, that's Alexia Chong. She just drops this awesome really? lyric, yeah, and then disappears. And everyone's going crazy. Wow, that's I never really knew good. she was like that. Then she came back, <laughs> and she did more. Wow. And it was at that moment I thought she should have stopped because yeah. essentially, <laughs> everyone thought off. she was freestyling. And then we were like, I think this is a Dre lyric. Oh, wow. And then she ran out of words. <laughs> and the entire group was really like, oh. Just keep beatboxing, yeah. not saying anything. Yeah. She, she, she ran out for, oh, for, for five minutes. I was like, Alexi Chung might That's be the great spider. What a celeb story? Salsa Day in Maryland? Yeah, right there. <laughs> you didn't know this about Alexa? <laughs> so um, in 2008, at your fringe, you performed three shows a day, really. You did yeah, solo hip hop. Four, four shows a day. Four shows. Mm. How do you, you know, stay motivated to go on to your next one? Is it about the audience? or? Yeah, I mean, that was. I, I, that was hectic. hectic. Yeah, I think it started about three, and then the last show ended where we are at the moment, Guild Blue, yeah. at about two thirty a.m. Wow. So for the last for the last show, which was a two hour show, yeah. uh, that I was comparing, I just I drink coffee. Yeah. <laughs> I just had a lot of coffee. But I think yeah, I think it's nice, and that's kind of one of the fun things about the fringe is you run yeah. from gig to gig. You, you end up doing a lot of shows. Yeah. Everyone seems to be doing quite a lot of shows. Yeah. Yeah. I think I wouldn't do it again. It's, I was going to say, would you do it again? <laughs> no, it's no, 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 no. <laughs> One show, two. As yeah, it's fine doing the kind of little guest spots, but yeah. that year I left a broken man. Yeah, must <laughs> be chatted. What a big like, break after that. Yeah, very yeah. much so. <laughs> so what do you do when you're not doing this, when you're not rapping or singing? Or uh, <laughs> I don't know. A lot of, a lot of time is kind of... What are your hobbies? What are my hobbies? What are my hobbies? I'm, I'm right. trying to learn piano at the moment. Bob, oh, really? Bob is teaching me. Oh wow! Bob is a keys genius. Is this to add into your show or just? It's for just a, it's just relax. To try, yeah. yeah. I can play like a little bit. I've got a few chords down. Do idea. Yeah, exactly. You know, yeah, I tried beginners. to learn. You know, with a guitar here, I had like a, a piano. Version. Oh yeah. So wow. I thought I'd learn through That's that, cool. but that 
But that went quite like, yeah. That's cool. Yeah, that's, that other, I'm trying to think of other things. We had a gig in so much. Yeah, but, that, that's what you have time for. Yeah, or just like reading books on the way there. Yeah. Poker. Poker, okay. I enjoy. <laughs> yeah, really. And so um, I looked up some words that people say you can't rhyme with. Right. Wow, here so we go. I'm gonna the big guns. Don't worry, I don't want to <laughs> no, throw it out there. I'm just going to try. I'll, I've actually found words that people say, what's wrong with it? Okay. So I'm going to give it to you and see if you can come up with the word that gotcha. rhymes with it. Right. So my first one is orange. Let's drop a beatbox. You got it? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so first of all, I got the knowledge this morning. Woke up, man, ate a bit of porridge. Follow this with the juice, yeah, straight on the orange one. Go astray, yep, I flow every day with OJ. Oh my god, that was See, brilliant. You got a few, you got a few. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> I was gonna say Florange, which is a hill in Wales. Uh -huh. <laughs> I knew but that. Did you know that? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Rob <laughs> was from Australia. I thought you knew the Welsh mountains. That's right. <laughs> I'm so impressed. No, I didn't know that either. Blimey. And um, the next one is just silver. Okay. <laughs> Quick to deliver. Words are rip, sir. I never go for gold. We are more silver. Yeah, but the words, man, you know I get dextrous before before the gold, because I am not Jessica Ennis. Ellis? Did I get the name wrong? I would have said chill, but a female lamb. You've got the <laughs> complex vocabulary. Yeah, I like this. All Wikipedia. This is. <laughs> so it probably I'd love to see the end scene, because just people would be like, oh, no. we need a dictionary. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Where is <laughs> Blorange? Blorange. Yeah. Blorange, Walsh Hill. Now you know that. Now you so know. Maybe you can use it in your next uh, yeah. show or Next something? time we tour Cardiff. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's going to be cool. They'll be so impressed that you can say at the end, this is owed to Caitlin Yeah, Waffle TV. Waffle TV. So yeah, thank you very much. It's been great Lunch, meeting thank you. you. And they're on from the 6th to the 27th of August at Pleasant Stone.